Stewart, thank you very much. With Randy Cabral, comes home third this afternoon. And might have seen a little smoke coming off that right rear. Um, a handling issue for you? Oh, yeah, big handling issue. I missed the setup today. I should have made some uh, other changes, which I was going to do, but I was too afraid because the cow was so good yesterday. Uh, but you know what? I got to thank this Bertrand crew and Cabral crew. We got two heat race wins this weekend and two top threes this weekend. So can't complain about anything more than that. I want to thank all the fans for coming out here in Waterford and thank Waterford Speedball for having us here. And I, I wish I can get the victory lane, but I don't know if I'll ever see you guys back there again. Well, hey, you'll get there. I know it's been a struggle for you here at uh, Waterford. You got eight wins and you'd love to make it nine. Uh, we're back here plenty more times and I'm sure uh, you'll get the setup. I hope so. Thanks a lot. All right, Randy Cabral comes home third. And uh, all the way down here, just past the uh, start finish line, is our uh, second place winner, our early leader in the event. We mentioned he picked up his uh, first win here at the Waterford Speed Bowl uh, last season. And a good, good run for the bug. Anthony Marvulio comes home second in the number 38. How was that for you? Oh, that was some fun racing. I mean, we were wheeled to wheel, me and Seth, right in the beginning. And then uh, to have that restart, and then me and Todd being wheeled to wheel for a lap or two. And then I have Randy charging on my outside. I'm like, oh, man. I got all these top running guys up here and, and here I am. I'm not able to come off the corner at all. You know, the car, I would lose the nose coming off, so I've been using the apron. But that was just some awesome wheel to wheel race and I had a blast. I'm happy for Todd. Um, you know, Randy, that was awesome. So, I mean, I, I, and honestly, my team, we didn't even know if the car was going to start this weekend. And uh, to come here, work, uh, we've been having steering issues the whole weekend. So uh, to come out here with the second, it, it was awesome. And my team did a tremendous job. I can't thank them enough. Well, you're right back here with another podium finish. Picked up your first ever win here last summer. And it looks like uh, you're in love with this place. Yeah, this place is awesome. You know, I, I, I really like the fact that they keep on wanting us to come back here. And, uh, you know, I'm looking forward to next time and see if hopefully we can get one better. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Anthony Marvulio winds up in the second spot. And Todd Bertrand, another one, as we mentioned, that uh, picked up his first win ever here at the ball. He is back in uh, victory lane. Has picked up a win here uh, in uh, three consecutive years right now. And Todd, uh, to say you, uh, you, you won this thing handily is an understatement. You dominated today. Well, I uh, saw the beginning of the race in front of me, and it was very exciting from my standpoint. And basically, I knew that my car didn't have enough stagger because we were pushing on exit and on entry. So I basically had to be kind of methodical with the way I was driving. I had to hit the apron on, on the entry and exit to get the car to turn or else I almost missed the corner by the center. But um, I mean, those guys put on a show in front of me. And then after that, I knew that Seth, he was getting kind of loose because he almost hit the wall there that one time. But those guys ran them, ran each other side by side. And then I kind of tucked it behind him. And then once Anthony got the lead, I kind of followed him a little bit. And uh, once I started catching him, um, you know, I knew he'd run me very clean on the restart. And this race means a lot to me. I'd like to dedicate this to Ellie Seymour, who passed away a couple weeks ago. I'd like to dedicate this race to my dad. You learned that from me. Shane Hammond as well. And um, the whole Cabral family, my family, they helped me so much. My girlfriend, Mariah, she was with me. This is a brand new car. It's the first time we've ever had it on the track this weekend. So I'm just extremely proud of my team. I'd like to thank my sponsors, Good Mornings Restaurant, Napa of Tallinn, Canon Oil Filters, and Atlantic Coast Trailers, but I can't thank my family enough, and I'm, I'm so blessed to be surrounded by the people I'm surrounded by, and, and this is awesome. I love this place. Well, uh, it's a great way to start the 2013 season, and I think you're going to give your uh, teammate a little run for the championship this year. Well, I mean, by the looks of this weekend, he's fast too, so we're going to have to be on our game every single weekend. Congratulations, Todd. Thank you very much, Pete. Todd Bertrand in victory lane in the number 39 in uh, dominating fashion today wins the opening event of the 2013 season for the NEMA Midgets. Matt? Okay, guys.